or something like that. You know? My goal is just to uh, try to be, uh, you know, expressive you know I mean? through photography and try to you know, get a message to the viewer. You know? and somehow, you know, create that balance of like mystery and nostalgia with, with, um, with, with a given purpose. You know what I mean? Something that's also marketable and usable. You know, to a fun. You know. So I mean, I have these two two sides to my work. I would say this is like commercial photography, Marlo, and that's. You know, like, okay, give the client what he wants. And then there's this other side that's more like fine art, you know, dark, mysterious, trying, you know, trying to um, cross the lines of politics and spirituality and blah, 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 blah. And that's some of my own, like, personal work versus, like, the commercial stuff, you know what I mean? So, um, and, 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 you know, man, it's like, like I'm just addicted to, to making images, you know? It's, it's, uh, photography to me became, like, this other this, this way of expressing and saying something. You know, it's like this bridge. You know, I had this this one part of me that was like scientific and wanted to be, you know, analytical and scientific, but then I had this little artist side of it that, that wanted to be, you know, I mean, this bohemian, you know, uh, uh, jet setter, except not in a jet, but like with a stick and a hanky, you know, uh, traveling around the world, man. You know what I mean? Like test, tasting cultures from around the world. You know, so the photography gave me that voice of trying to bridge this analytical side of who I, who I was and this uh, artist side. So I was able to put all these things together. You know, probably just in the nick of time, man. Because uh, you know, it's funny because like it, it's amazing. But even the story of how I got to college, you know, it's probably pretty crazy. I mean, like in high school. Beginning of my high school career, I just wasn't motivated. You know, what I, mean? I wasn't motivated to perform in school. In fact, uh, I mean, actually, I was like a skateboarder. You know what I mean? And all of all those were skateboards um, with like my other skateboard homeboys. And I was just bored, man. I was just bored. I motivated, didn't feel challenged, and, and, and really almost didn't make it out of high school until uh, I felt like. I met some cool people like myself and some other people, you know what I mean, that was, you know, in, in, in the uh, at the of man, that, that kind of like reeled it back in for me, you know what I mean, sometimes you have to like go way out and then reel it back in, you know what I mean, to get your foundation in your, in, in, in your base. And then um, somehow it started to click. You know what, you know, I think I do, I do want to finish this cool thing. And, uh, and, and then what's after this? You know what I mean? What's up this? What's next? You know, what's, you know, but um, I really do believe, like, especially to the youth, it's about exposure, you know what I mean? It's about being exposed, man. Like, like if you just in stay place. Yeah, absolutely. And that's what, that's what I like about one of your places. And it's about exposure. It's about bringing, you know, it's like, cool. You know, we can go here and you guys are going to bring it. I mean, bring that information, bring the artists, bring, bring uh, a community, you know what I mean, together. You know what I mean? So people can have a place so that they can understand you know, like, what the possibilities are. We wanted to make everybody feel like what we want to give you is something different that nobody else is doing. You know, when you look at the name One Ebony, it's like One Ebony. Ebony Ivory, I right? think it's, 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 a, it's a combination of everything. Exactly. You know, and it's a place, and a place that you can either call home. So we wanted to make everybody feel like this is hard, you know, that's why it's not strictly this is hard. And, and for, for me to be interviewing, you know, my man, you know, it's, it's kind of, it makes me feel more comfortable. Because I get comfortable with anybody. Right, right, right. And, uh, you know, these questions, everything that we do, you know, we want everybody to feel like you can talk to them as well. Right. You know, you know being, being with the superstars and being everywhere, it's fine, but right now we're talking about real 